हेलो बच्चो लेट सीट द क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन बीड ऑफ मास एम स्टेज एट पॉइंट पी ए कॉमा बी ऑन ए वायर बेंट इन द शेप ऑफ ए पैराबोला वाई इज इक्वल टू फोर सी एक्स स्क्वायर एंड रोटेटिंग विथ एंगुलर स्पीड ओमेगा एज सोन इन द फिगर द वैल्यू ऑफ ओमेगा इज वी हैव टू नेग्लेक्ट फ्रिक्शन सो वी विल सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वील सी वट विल बी द की कंसेप्ट इज इन दिस क्वेश्चन the key concept used in this question will be the slope of a straight line slope of a straight line which is tangent to a curve which is tangent to curve y is equal to 4cx square is tan theta is equal to dy by dx that is 8cx so if we draw a straight line which is tangent to this curve at this point p suppose this is the straight line which is tangent to this curve parabola at this point p so the straight line will have a slope that is this is if this is theta so tan theta will be equal to 8 cx now we have for point p for point p a comma b x coordinate will be equal to a so tan theta will be equal to 8 ca now we will see the free body diagram of the bead now suppose this is bead so the centrifugal force will act radially outward that is m omega square r and this is r that is a so m omega square a and the weight of the bead will be radially downward that is mg and this is Angle theta. This is angle theta. So this will be ninety minus theta. So again, this will be theta, and this will be ninety minus theta. This will be theta. So if we take the component of both the centrifugal forces and weight along this line, that is tangent. So this will be m omega square a. cos alpha cos theta sorry and the component of weight along this tangent will be mg sin theta now as the bead is in a steady circular motion so for a steady circular motion steady circular motion we will have mg sin theta Is equal to m omega square a cos theta. So we have mg sin theta is equal to m omega square a cos theta. Or from here we will have tan theta is equal to omega square a by g. So from here tan theta. We have already found that is 8 ca. So we will just put the value of tan theta. That is 8 ca. That will be omega square a by g. So a and a will get cancelled. So omega square will be equal to 8 cg, or omega will be equal to 2 root 2 gc. So the correct option will be option a. Hope you all understood it well. Best of luck.